Okay, so in this video I kind of wanted to go over what I use for a tool pouch. I'm not sponsored by anybody or anything like that. So all these tools I use because I want to use these tools. Uh, this pouch that I use is actually for HVAC. It's HVAC Tech Series VBTO Pro Pack. Uh, tool bag that works is what it says and this one is the TP3 I have my big wad of different fire alarm keys so I can get into different panels and do different things uh, if you're missing any keys uh, I'll include my email in the description email me and it might be something that I can send you one of the keys if you need it uh, for a small fee. That way I, it'll help fund the videos I do. Um, the meter that I use is a Fluke. Uh, it's a 117 a True RMS meter. I think I got that at Mayor Electric. And get the magnet part that hangs on the back. See how tight this is in here so when I'm in an attic I don't lose it. But it's got a fluke makes this little this little magnet right here where while you're working you, know, you can stick the meter then you got both hands uh, free to use your meter so you're not having to hold your meter and try to uh, use it at the same time. these lineman pliers see they're in really good shape no nicks or cuts in the handles if you nick one of these always replace the rubbers on it so you don't get shocked I typically don't mess with any kind of voltage a little bit of rusting will hurt nothing but as you can see they move really easy and free so I have those for any kind of bigger wiring and I highly recommend these, okay? And those little Klein ones, the little blue ones, they'll jump off track and stuff like that. I had these about four years. They're Milwaukee brand. And uh, they're just, they're really heavy, uh, good made. The rubber on them is really good. Uh, sometimes that'll clip close while I'm working. I don't like that, but while it's in the pouch, it's good to have that little clip there. But it's still better than Klein's. Klein's will close and lock on you all the time. It's got little hangers here. See those little things? Some people require you have tool tile. So this makes it pretty easy. You can just hook a little hook in there, twist it around it, and then hook it on your bungee cord. Uh, so it's really good to have. That's one thing about my Klein's. It doesn't have a place for tool tile off if you're dealing with that. Uh, I use this screwdriver. It's made in the USA. Um, that's one of the things about the Klein screwdrivers. I quit using them because they quit being made in the USA and they would always, they started getting to where they would strip out the, the tip of the bit would strip out. So I, I just totally quit using them all together because of that. Uh, this screwdriver is really good. You cannot pry with it though, okay? Because that tube right there will bend. So it ain't like a Milwaukee or something where you can stick it in there and pry something open. This is made for strictly screwdriver. And so all my bits are up in there. And that's, it takes a little bit to pop that open, which is a good thing. So you don't lose your bits. Okay. I have this one. So these are for my tamper proof screwdriver. See it's got the little hole in the end. Same thing. So when you're not using it, you know, you can put put all your bits up in there. So that way it keeps them secure. I hadn't run across too many tampers that this this thing won't open up, you know, tamper-proof screws and stuff. 
I have a bigger tweaker. It's Milwaukee brand. I've never broke the tip on one of these. And one that's a little bit smaller. That just fits some nuts in most panels taking the panel apart. So, 516. And that's it.